Welcome to The Pulse, your regular burst of news from New Eden. The explosive velocity update to EVE Online is coming on the 24th of November as part of the Phoenix Quadrant. There will be changes to damage application for torpedoes, as well as updates to Dreadnought class hulls such as the Phoenix and the Moros, and also balance changes to the Griffin Navy issue and stealth bombers. A new Abyssal Proving Grounds event is also now live in EVE. Until downtime on the 24th of November, you can engage in 2v2 tactical destroyer combat. Don't forget to check the news item for details on limitations and keep track of capsular performance using the leaderboards. EVE Portal, the official companion app for EVE Online, has just had a major update. Alpha players now have full access to all features, including the G2Plex market and skill management. EVE Portal is also now localized into more languages and you can now trade and use skill injectors. Japanese localization for the EVE Online client will become available on the 8th of December. The EVE Online webpage, EVE Store, Account Management, Player Experience, Official Forums, an official EVE Twitter account and the EVE Portal Companion app have already been introduced with Japanese localization, with even more to come following the 8th of December release. This weekend marks the finals of the Alliance Open Tournament hosted by EVE NT, with last week's action serving up explosions, joyous victories and stunning defeats. There were massive upsets such as Vydra being knocked out of the loser's bracket by Warlords of the Deep and a single Brave Alliance Griffin jamming out Fraternity's wildcard Etana, turning the match in their favour. Be sure to catch the finals this weekend on EVE NT's Twitch channel and check out CCP TV's EVE Academy stream from the 19th of November on what to look for when watching an EVE tournament. If you're a content creator, the EVE Online Partnership Programme is our way of saying thanks and is here to help you to continue to grow your audience and to serve the EVE community. The EVE Online community is full of passionate players who dedicate their time and talent to create content that enhances player experience in and out of game. Partners will receive game time support, exclusive skins to give away, access to developers and promotion for their content. Be sure to check out the link in the description for full details and guidelines. The popular Hazard Control skin has returned to the New Eden store. Originally available for select Minmatar ships only, the series has been expanded to 52 Minmatar ship types. In addition, you can get 25% off the Morphite Shine and Tronhadar Ink skin lines until downtime on the 24th of November, after which they will be retired from the New Eden store. The monthly economic report is now available. Remember, you can download all of the raw data used in the report by following the link in the blog and all images can be enlarged. We're proud to announce the Rix Javix collection of EVE merchandise for the EVE gear store. This special collaboration brings Rix's unique artistic style to life, so be sure to check out the Freaky Frigates t-shirt, magnet set and journal set in store. That's all for this episode of The Pulse, thank you for joining us. Remember to check the description below or the comments on Facebook for more information on the stories we've covered. Hit subscribe to stay notified of any new videos that we post. And now, word from our sponsors.